Tutorial 33 in this tutorial we're going to talk about the guided lofted boss or the advanced lofted boss we have this profile created in the previous tutorial when we inserted planes and the sketches we turn the planes off that they are hidden so here is show and then when you click on the glass hide we hide the plane so we'll be able to work on the sketches so now we want to make a guided line so that the lot will going to follow so let's insert a sketch or a guiding line on a plane that is passing through them so we choose top plane insert sketch number two so now we can start making a spline intersecting with these profiles and if you found it kind of tricky to intersect with the profiles we can try to project or convert the sketches so convert entities and then you convert them into construction so now we have reference for the for the sketches here so now let's insert a spline in the shape we want this is intersecting with the profile as you see here and then down right click select so we have our profiles and we have our guiding curve here so let's exit sketch activate lifted boss and here let's select the profiles let's be sure that we selecting it okay so this is the original lifted boss without any guided curve and here in this menu the guided curve let's activate it and select this curve so when you are done you will see the results so you have the lofted boss follow that guided line so let's try to insert another guided line so let's edit this sketch and here we have another uh, spline so now we have two uh, splines you can decide the shape how you want and make them but here we show you the idea of the guided lifted line so exit activate the lifted boss the profiles for the guided line select this one click ok and then select the second one ok so you have two guided lines and it works as well so this is the idea how to use the guided lofted boss.